Welcome back. It's California Edition. I'm Brad Pomerantz, and we are joined by Kyla Detman. She is the Executive Director of the Land Conservancy of San Luis Obispo County, which is what? It's a local <laughs> nonprofit land trust working to protect special places in our county. And I know it well. I know you do great work. And an exciting project is before us. It's known as the Pismo Preserve. Tell us all about it. The Pismo Preserve is what we consider a once in a lifetime opportunity to protect an amazing um, 900 acres that serves as the backdrop to the city of Pismo Beach and the entire five cities. Currently owned by a private LLC. I understand they were considering development. Yes. But the conservancy has gotten involved. Where do we stand? Well, where we stand is that we have um, entered into a purchase and sale agreement with those sellers, and they're really um, they're moving forward with us together as a partnership. And we have raised 5.6 million towards the 12 million dollar purchase, and we we have a little bit of a ways to go, right. but we're we're really excited. So let's talk about what you are looking to get done. I know that you're working with private entities, mm -hmm. public entities, to try to raise the money. A total of 12 million dollars. You have until August to raise that money. Is there something that we can do, the viewers can do, if they're interested in donating to this project? Yeah, we are relying on a combination of donations um, from private and the local individuals mm -hmm. all the way up to the state agencies. Right, so state we, of California. Yeah, yeah, same, right. yeah, exactly. And we we need people to, they can just go to our website if they want to learn more about how to donate at lcslo.org. Mm -hmm. So we're every donation counts. So we've the smallest donation we've had was two dollars from a four year old girl. It counts. And every little bit adds up. And so people can that's a simple way to help is to send us some funds to help towards the purchase. But also people can attend some upcoming public meetings that we have to show local um, municipalities how much they want the project to happen and help us purchase this property. So assuming the purchase goes forward, and I'm sure it will, what can we expect from the Pismo Preserve? Because even though it's preserved, something still needs to be done with it. I mean, right. you got to maintain it and, and et cetera. Exactly. Well, the unique thing about this project, I, I, some of the lesser known projects that right. we've done are conservation easements, where we work with a willing seller and we, you know, we remove the development rights. Okay. In this particular case, we are purchasing this for the public to enjoy. So this will be owned by the Land Conservancy and we will operate as a public park for people to hike, mountain bike, ride horses with panoramic views of the Pacific Ocean. Oh my, now yeah. that costs money though, it I does. presume, yes. to keep the trails yep. intact, mm -hmm. to keep the benches, yep. you know, <laughs> weather resistant. What happens then? You know, the purchase goes through part of your operating budget? Yeah, well, actually, a part of the purchase price is that the sellers will be donating back an endowment to us. So we will have, <laughs> we will we like have an endowment. Sellers. We like these yeah. sellers a lot. We, have an, we will have an endowment to help support ongoing operations. So we will, and we will have pledges from local groups like Central Coast Concerned Mountain Bikers, right. and, um, horseback riding groups like Ride Napomo and others that have committed to helping us maintain trails, you know, provide a lot of volunteer time for that. But we have the basic financial means th you know, to, to support it in the long term, pay our property taxes and have you know, liability insurance and all right. that. So it'll be covered. <laughs> And so where do we go from here? Because the, you know we're still in the game. Where do right. we go from here? From here, we are hoping to, well, there's a couple of pots of money that we need right. to raise. Um, we're looking to the city of Pismo Beach, as well as the city of San Luis Obispo, city of Rio Grande, and is others. It, is, is it county land or is it, it city is land? It is county. Okay. It just it borders the city limits for the city of Pismo. Okay. Um, the county of San Luis Obispo, just two weeks ago, right. um, approved 1.1 million towards the purchase. Oh, that's for real. Yeah, and uh -huh. so local government's already stepping up and, and helping and well, so best of yeah. luck congratulations the website is lcslo.org dot org she is kyla detman she is with the land conservancy of san luis obispo county my name is brad palmer thank you so much for joining us we're going to send you back to hln